In the world of modern manufacturing, precision and efficiency are key to producing high-quality products, often at an industrial scale. This is where CNC, or Computer Numerical Control, machines come into play. CNC machines use computerized systems to control machining tools and create complex parts with exceptional accuracy, speed, and repeatability. From automotive parts to intricate aerospace components, CNC machines have become integral to manufacturing in a variety of industries. What is a CNC machine? A CNC, Computer Numerical Control, machine is an automated, programmable device that processes materials by controlling machining tools such as drills, mills, lathes, and routers. Unlike traditional manual machining, where each movement and operation is controlled by a machinist, CNC machines operate based on digital instructions, allowing for precise, repeatable actions without human intervention. This technology has revolutionized manufacturing by increasing speed, accuracy, and consistency in the production process. The term CNC reflects the machine's capability to interpret numerical data to control its actions. These instructions come from a code, typically called G-code, which is generated through CAD, computer-aided design, and CAM, computer-aided manufacturing, software. This code specifies movements, cutting speeds, and positions, guiding the machine to create complex parts and shapes with remarkable precision. Main components of a CNC machine. A CNC machine consists of various essential components that work together to execute precise machining tasks. Each part plays a specific role, allowing the machine to operate efficiently and accurately. Here are the main components. One, controller. Description. The controller, often considered the brain of the CNC machine, is a computer system that interprets G-code instructions from CAD CAM software and sends commands to other components to control movements, speeds, and tool functions. Role, converts digital instructions into mechanical actions, ensuring precise positioning and tool movements along the designated axes. Two, drive system description. The drive system is composed of motors, either stepper or servo motors, and drives that move the machine's components along the X, Y, and Z axes. These motors provide the power needed to position the tool or workpiece accurately. Roll, controls the motion of the machine along different axes, allowing for precise and smooth movements that match the programmed instructions. Three, spindle description. The spindle is a rotating component that holds and rotates the cutting tool, or in some cases, the workpiece itself. It is powered by a motor, and its speed and torque can be adjusted based on the material and type of machining operation. Roll, drives the cutting tool or workpiece at varying speeds, allowing for controlled cuts, drills, and other machining processes. Four, cutting tools description. These are the tools used for cutting, drilling, milling, or shaping the workpiece material. CNC machines can use a variety of tools, such as end mills, drill bits, and lathes, depending on the machining process. Roll, perform the actual material removal and shaping operations based on the instructions provided by the controller. Five, table description. The table is a flat surface where the workpiece is mounted or clamped. Tables can be stationary or movable, depending on the type of CNC machine. Roll, holds the workpiece securely in place, preventing movement or vibration during machining, which is critical for accuracy. Six, axis system, X, Y, Z, and sometimes A, B. Description, CNC machines operate along different axes, typically X, left, right, Y, front, back, and Z, up, down. Some advanced machines include additional rotational axes, A and B, for complex five-axis machining. Roll, allows for precise positioning and movement of the tool or workpiece along multiple planes, making it possible to create complex geometries. Seven, feedback system description. Often referred to as an encoder or position feedback device, this component continuously monitors the machine's position and movement, sending real-time data back to the controller. Roll, ensures accuracy by detecting any discrepancies between programmed commands and actual movements, allowing the machine to make adjustments as needed. Eight, cooling system description. The cooling system includes coolant pumps and nozzles that spray coolant on the workpiece and cutting tool during machining. The coolant is typically a liquid that reduces heat generated by friction. Roll, prevents overheating of both the cutting tool and workpiece, increasing tool life and maintaining dimensional accuracy. Nine, 
Lubrication System Description CNC machines often include a lubrication system to reduce friction on moving parts like guideways and lead screws. Roll ensures smooth, consistent movement of mechanical components and prevents wear, improving machine longevity and performance. 10. Bed or Frame Description The bed or frame is the base structure of the CNC machine, providing a solid foundation that supports other components. Roll absorbs vibrations and provides stability during machining, which is essential for precision and preventing any disruption to the machining process. 11. Tool Changer, Automatic Tool Changer, or ATC. Description. In many CNC machines, an automatic tool changer, ATC, is used to switch between tools automatically during operations. Roll. Increases efficiency by enabling the machine to complete multiple machining tasks without manual intervention, allowing for continuous production. Each of these components is crucial to the function of a CNC machine, working in unison to execute complex, precise, and repeatable machining operations. Together, they make CNC machines powerful tools for industries that require high accuracy and productivity. How does a CNC machine work? A CNC machine follows a series of programmed steps to shape materials into precise parts. The entire process involves creating a digital design, translating it into machine instructions, and executing the machining operations. Here's a step-by-step -step breakdown of how a CNC machine works. 1. Designing the part, CAD, computer-aided design. Description. The first step in any CNC machining process is designing the part using CAD software. This software allows engineers or designers to create a 2D or 3D model of the part, specifying exact dimensions and geometries. Purpose provides a blueprint for the final product and ensures that every detail and measurement is accounted for before manufacturing begins. 2. Converting the design into instructions, CAM, computer-aided manufacturing. Description. Once the design is complete, it is imported into CAM software, where it is translated into machine-readable instructions, known as G-code. The G-code specifies the exact movements, toolpaths, and speeds for the CNC machine. Purpose creates a detailed set of instructions that tell the machine how to move, where to cut, and at what speed to operate, allowing for precise control over the machining process. 3. Setting up the machine. Description. Before running the program, the operator sets up the CNC machine. This involves securing the workpiece to the table, installing the correct tools in the spindle, and setting up any required fixtures or clamps. Purpose ensures that the workpiece is positioned correctly and that the machine is configured for the specific operations needed for the job. 4. Running a test run. Optional. Description. Many operators perform a dry run or simulation to verify the G-code program. This test run ensures that the program works as intended, without risking damage to the machine, tools or workpiece. Purpose allows the operator to check for errors in the program, or setup, and make adjustments before the actual machining begins. 5. Executing the machining process description. Once everything is set, the operator starts the CNC machine, which begins executing the programmed instructions. The machine follows the G-code commands to move along its axes, rotating the tool or workpiece and cutting material as specified. Movement control. Motors and drives control movement along the X, Y, and Z axes, while the controller manages speed and tool rotation. Cutting and shaping. The cutting tool, held in the spindle, moves according to the instructions to remove material and create the desired shape. Purpose converts the digital model into a physical part by machining the material in precise steps, often including milling, drilling, turning, or other processes depending on the machine and material. 6. Monitoring and adjustments. Description. During the machining process, the operator monitors the machine to ensure it's running smoothly. Modern CNC machines often have sensors and feedback systems that allow for real-time adjustments. Purpose ensures the machining process remains within tolerance and can quickly address issues such as tool wear, vibrations, or temperature fluctuations. 7. Finishing and quality control. Description. After the machining process is complete, the part is removed from the machine. Some CNC parts may require post-processing, such as deburring, polishing, or heat treatment. The finished part is then inspected to verify that it meets quality and dimensional specifications. Purpose guarantees that the final product meets the required standards and quality, ensuring the part is ready for use or further assembly. 
8. Cleanup and Maintenance Description The operator cleans the CNC machine, removes any leftover material, and conducts routine maintenance. This can involve tool replacement, lubrication, and checking alignment to keep the machine in optimal working condition. Purpose Maintains the machine's longevity and ensures consistent performance for future jobs.